Shading, adding darkness to the side of an object that faces away from an imaginary light source. First of all, decide where your light source would be coming from. Is it from the side? Is it directly above? Um, what is it? Is it a sun? Is it a lamp? You don't always actually have to draw the light source. Just by adding shading, your viewer gets the sense that there is a light source. I'm going to go ahead and make a circle, and I'm going to turn this circle into a ball. Wherever is the furthest point away from our light source is where we start the shading. Always shade in the direction of the shape. Okay, You never just want to kind of go however like that. If it's a circle, curve with it. Okay, Start by adding the darkest layer of your shading and then gradually with your pencil kind of ease up on it, on the pressure. I am using a 6B drawing pencil. The lead is much softer. It's the graphite. This will allow me to blend my shading. Okay. And it does take some time to do a nice job. Okay. As I get lighter and lighter, I try to hold my pencil more on the side of it. Okay. Now, when I feel I've added enough shading, you can actually take this as a blending tool, which is going to push the pencil around into the fibers of the paper and smooth it together. It's also going to continue uh, blending that pencil tone. And I can use the pencil tone that's on my blending tool to actually do some of the shading itself. This very, very light layer of shading um, is very difficult to do with a pencil on its own, so the blending tool is a great help for that. Same thing, blend in the direction of your shape. Okay. And then go ahead and show. It still faces the light source. Now we can tell it's meant to be more of a ball or a sphere and that is shading.